Fresh Bricks here, and today we are back with episode two of the Fresh Bricks podcast. Sorry, guys, about um, delaying it. We had a couple audio issues with recording it the first time. But anyway, guys, real quick before we get into this, make sure you guys drop a like and a subscribe. And I'm thinking about doing multiple segments, like a meme segment, a news segment, just general talk segment. So let me know what you guys think about that in the comment section down below. But anyway, let's get right into this. First, we'll talk about the uh, the recent Clone Wars episode. Um, I believe it was episode 6. Um, I don't know what it was called, but this episode was pretty cool. Um, the whole Soko arc right now could be better. It's okay, but it could be better. I honestly wish it was better. Um, but yeah... Honestly, I like action in shows, and these first two episodes just don't have a lot of action. Um, they don't have a lot of explosions, blasting. That's what action I mean. Um, but yeah, they just don't have that much action, and those many action sequences, no battles, no really anything. But what I do like is they left us on this cliffhanger where they were about to get tracked in with a tractor beam by the pikes. And they ended up just ending the episode there, so we gotta wait till next week or this week, whatever you guys wanna say, um, for to see what happens. So yeah, I think this episode was overall it was pretty good. Could have been better, but it's acceptable. Um, but yeah, next up we'll talk about the new Lego Masters episode, bro. Aaron and Christian getting eliminated. What are you talking about? What the, I, I don't get this, bro. This is rigged. No, I'm kidding. Um, but yeah. So, this episode was pretty good. Um, I like the concept how they were teaming up with different builders to, like, build a battle. So, it was pretty cool. I didn't like how they only used Series 19 minifigures, though. I mean, like, it seemed kind of weird. Like, they picked a bounty hunter to be a hero. I mean, it does kind of seem irrelevant because... The Mandalorian was a bounty hunter, but he still was a hero. So, yeah. But Aaron and Christian did get eliminated, sadly. Um, pretty sad. They were probably my favorite builders, either between Mark and Boone or Aaron and Christian. So, sorry to you guys. Um, I'm really sorry about that. Um, but, yeah. So, what else do I think about this episode? Well, um, like I said, I like the concept of them teaming up and stuff. Terry Crews coming in, um, he was pretty cool, I think that's his name, Terry Crews, he was pretty cool, I like this entrance where he smashed the wall, um, they actually, the, uh, the contestants actually got pieces of the wall he smashed through, and they were all signed, so that was pretty cool, I saw it on Instagram, um, but yeah, so next up, we'll talk about the Pirates Bay set, Uh, oh yeah, wait, forget, before we talk about that, um, I want to talk about the new oh so the next episode of lego masters it's a star wars episode let's go it's star wars they're, i think they're gonna be building um endor they're building like epic battles and they're gonna have like three po there r2 d2 bb8 and i think the epic battles they're building are hoth um crate and endor so that's gonna be that's gonna be pretty cool um, I'm excited to get who who gets see who gets eliminated now because this is like the some of the best builders. So it's kind of getting like really scary at the end. Um, I'm excited to see too what the season finale is. I was thinking, I think I talked about this before, but I, I'm thinking of this good idea where they bring back all the old contestants. Um, that would be pretty cool. But um, yeah. So next up, we will talk about the Pirates Bay set. Now, this set is amazing. And a wonderful, not wonderful for me, but a wonderful for some other people, but a wonderful price point of $200. Now, probably won't be picking this set up because of $200. Like, I I can't just pull $200 out of my pocket. I mean, money doesn't, I mean, technically does. Um, but yeah. So I think this set's really cool. You got you can like transform it into the old one or just into a regular ship if you don't want it to be like crashed and stuff. Um but yeah, it has like old box art, so that's pretty cool. Um But yeah, that set is pretty cool. I like some of the minifigures too. They're like 
from their like recreations of the old one. Um, but yeah, so that's what I think of that set. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you guys want to, we can talk about the whole COVID-19. It sucks. It's terrible. That's all I'm going to say because I, I want this to be positive, not negative with the coronavirus. So anyway, guys, that's pretty much it for today's podcast. Sorry if it's short. We didn't have that much um, stuff to talk about. So let me know if you guys want different segments like general talk, news, memes, Whatever you guys want, I can put it in this podcast. But anyway, guys, that is pretty much it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure you guys drop a like and a subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.